Hi, I'm Troy from Peak Dirt Works. Uh, today we're going to go over a little setup that we use for our laser system when we do uh, culverts and driveways and whatnot. We've got a um, Spectra GL622N uh, dual grade capable laser. It'll do grades up to 25% on two axes. Um, the first thing I did is I set it up. Uh, we try to set the tripod up level because then if you need to use the elevator, it doesn't change the laser that much. Um, we also, this laser has alignment marks on the top for both axes, basically like sights on a gun. And basically what we did is I've got that thing sighted kind of up the general line of this road where we're going to be working. Obviously there's a curve in this road, but I've got it generally set up basically in line with the road parallel. Um, now what I'm going to do is basically I'm going to come about one step off the edge of the road and I'm going to come out exactly perpendicular to our laser and I'm going to set our detector basically as a baseline okay so that should be close enough for our baseline here then what we're going to do follow me up here we're going to go up the road basically just in this area that we're working there's the center of our driveway All right, so we've just come up past our work area. Probably about the same distance that the, we are from the, you know, the laser is from the center of the driveway. Not really a big deal. But then I'll take that one step off the edge of the road. So we're in about the same area. And then I will take this remote. I'll go to the menu. I'll go over to plane lock, or I'm sorry, grade match. And we're gonna grade match on the Y axis. Press enter, and we sit hold this and basically the laser is going to find this level and it's going to set the laser beam at the grade of the road we can lock that in and then anything we do uh, for this culvert of this driveway at this entrance can be the same grade as the road so right now we're looking at almost eight percent grade on this road Okay, so now basically we have a laser beam that is the exact slope as this road, and then now we can go in there and adjust. We're allowed to um, be 4% grade off the road before we can do a max of 17% as we get up through the driveway. So we'll get this set up. So I can go into this menu now and go to down to the X axis. And we're gonna go ahead and put in a negative 4%. Press enter. But now we'll basically have the laser parallel with the road and then with a 4% incline going into the property. So then now we'll go up here. If this is where we want to start. Basically the center of the driveway, edge of the road. Okay, so we'll say about five foot ten, which is just an arbitrary deal that's basically from there so then from here no matter where I move this stick it'll go up at a four percent it'll go up at a four percent uh, grade and it'll also stay parallel with the road so it's kind of funny look I have my mark already there That's from when I did the survey work before. So my mark on that stake was where I felt I needed to be. So we're within about an inch of that. So uh, that stake is about 20 feet in from the edge of the road, which is where we've got to carry this only 4%. So as you can see, we've got to cut a canyon uh, into the side of this hill. But this stuff will make it uh, fairly easy. 
So now we're gonna set up the uh, detector on the excavator. So basically what we've done now is we've taken our excavator and we've set the stick portion and we put it plumb basically. I mean, we're not gonna put a level on it, but it's plumb enough to where I, that's what I'll be looking at to get a measurement. And I've got the bucket uncurled, rolled all the way out. And I've got the teeth down at the grade that we want. So now I can take this CR700 detector and we've still got our laser running. I should be able to put this on the stick. Oh, it's in the wrong, we have to, we're gonna have to move the laser up a little bit. So what we'll do is we can actually, gotta make sure that's not gonna hit this. I don't think it will. We can put this on there. Even though it's not set exactly right yet, I'll go down to the laser and we'll raise it up. You have to go up there and tell me when that turns green. Okay. More. There. Solid green. And now we can use that to pull our 4% grade uh, in 20 feet. And once we do that, we'll change it to 17%, which is the next max that we're allowed to do. Driveway entry at 4% from the road. And I've got this set 20 feet in from the road where we have to have our 4%. From here we can go 17% is the max. So I've got my teeth at grade right now on that line. So then now I can leave that. I'm gonna move the laser so I can more get kind of a, a line to this driveway and we'll set that at 17% and then we'll uh, we'll go from there. waiting for our laser to get set at 17 percent okay it's spinning now so now see we can find a place where it zeroes out and is green and then we mount it on the stick so now from this point on we'll be digging at 17 percent going up this hill so let's just continue to hog out more dirt with a never-ending dirt pile
on everybody we're about ready to button this one up uh, we've had the compactor on it a little bit but I was just going to show you that um, you probably had the video before where we set up the laser set up the grades we can only have a maximum of four percent into about this 20 foot mark and then from there we can only have a max of 17 percent so we brought out the level and we'll just do it's basically based on the center line of the driveway so if we put this on the center line on this first part let that settled out so we're at about three percent two and a half percent if we come up here where the driveway starts the center line of the driveway about 15 percent as we make our way up center line of the driveway once again 14% and like I said you can adjust that even if I move this it's going to change it a little bit so come up here center line of the roadway this is our 17 so that's probably the steepest part of the driveway and once we get up here we're back into the 12% range and then as we go up, we probably have 10 or less for the rest of the way. So that's today's um, demonstration. For more details on the laser seen in this video, see the description below. Be sure to comment and let us know what you think and subscribe to our channel for more videos.